fire at a junkyard in Elizabeth, and now an investigation is underway. News 12 New Jersey's Marcy Rubin joins us now with more on this. And Marcy, actually, it was viewers who brought this to our attention. Yeah, absolutely, Rick. All of this happening around rush hour last night, and we'll show you some of the videos sent to us by viewers in just a moment. First, you can take a look behind me across this uh, street here, and you can see the damage done to some of these cars. Investigators telling us about 35 were involved in this fire yesterday. Now, take a look now at the video that drivers going through Elizabeth around 6 p.m. saw yesterday intense smoke coming from what turned out to be a junk yard, a car junkyard. We are in an industrial area of Elizabeth, so there were not many people around at that time and no injuries were reported. Elizabeth Fire responded. They were able to put the fire out in about two hours, and we have video from today of what is left behind these gates. Now, investigators haven't gone into count up the exact numbers, but they believe it's between 30 and 40 cars that uh, caught fire. Some of them just destroyed, just shells right now. Uh, the lot is owned by a company called Highway Services. They are a towing company in Elizabeth, and I'm told this lot is where vehicles are brought after an accident or if they are involved in a police investigation of some sort. On scene here today, we have investigators with Union County's Fire Investigation Task Force, the State Fire Marshal's uh, Office, also the Sheriff's Office Crime Scene Unit, and Elizabeth Police, all of them working together to try to figure out how this started and exactly where in this lot it started. I am told that this, this type of investigation is procedure when a fire is that big. And again, 35, 40-ish cars were uh, involved in this fire. And when we learn what may have caused it, we, of course, will pass that along to you. For now, we are in Elizabeth Marcy Rubin, News 12, New Jersey.